Hey there, Shuby Doodlers. How are you doing today? Well, this is, um, I don't know how many Halloween videos I've done so far now, but anyway, there's kind of two or three to go now. 30th, there's two. Today's the 30th of October. And then tomorrow is Halloween. <laughs> and then I'm going to stop. So this, you want this kind of overly shape for the head and an overly shape for the body. And then that's going to kind of come down into a wing. And then you're going to want a tail. And then you're going to want legs and then the beak. So let's ink this in. Now, now the raven has a really long kind of hooked bill and then this wants to come back like that and then around and kind of down like that and then we'll take that back to about there and then we want it to have this really sort of shrugging its shoulders in a a kind of, you know, kind of way. <laughs> I can't think of a way to describe it. But, you know, in that kind of creepy, kind of sitting there watching, watching what's going on. Now I'm leaving a little kind of a white line around here for the, um, that's going to be the tail there. This is going to, 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 to delineate the wing a little bit there. And then ravens kind of have hackles underneath their throat so we can bring that oh maybe sort of curving down like that and then we are going to do a, a kind of an eye I make this reasonably large I think and then I'm going to draw the eyeball in like that and this is all going to be in silhouette to give it that kind of um, Halloween-y kind of look so we're going to want to have sort of claws like that. And we're going to bring a kind of a branch in here. And remember, the, 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 I think the, the key word is branch. So, so when you're drawing a branch, then it just keeps branching into, uh, into these little bits like that. And you can sort of maybe do another bit there. And you can maybe sort of put something on the ends of them as well. And we can maybe make it a bit knobbly as well and i'm just going to have one last kind of bit sort of going off down there yeah, that will do it and maybe i'm just going to have another bit there because that will just kind of add to the the sense of the whole thing now when you are sure that the ink is dry, then you can erase those pencil lines because otherwise you're going to get ink smudged all over the place. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to do some scribbly kind of shading all up and down this branch in the middle. And then I'm going to ink in the lower sections so we get a kind of a highlight on the top. So I'm now using my um, Pentel pocket brush pen which kind of fills in black really nice and quickly, but it's 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 very, very sensitive brush. So uh, you need to kind of practice with it a little bit to get the feel, but it flows beautifully. And I gave up sort of trying to ink with brushes some time ago, well, a long, long time ago, um, because it, it's such a pain to, <laughs> to clean. And and I find that ink sort of makes brushes sort of go, go bad quite quickly. And, um, but this is just really, really nice. It has a, it's cartridge, so you just fill it up. You just stick another cartridge in when it dries up. And, um, and it's just always there, ready to use. Whereas getting out a brush and a pot of ink is kind of business, I find. As ever, I got links to it down below. And while I'm doing this, why don't you click the subscribe button and make sure you're subscribed to draw stuff real easy and keep coming back for a nice, easy kind of how to draw videos. Um, at least every week. Sometimes I do these sort of things where I do quite a lot, you know, one a day for a week or something like that on a theme. And also, if you're liking this video, then do please click that like button as well, because it really sort of <laughs> helps to make my videos more um, sort of noticed by other people. Now, I've done that kind of scribbly bit there. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to um, just ink in the bottom half and then we'll get that kind of like it's the moonlight shining on sort of a, the twigs of a wet branch. So there you go, how to draw a Halloween raven real easy.
Well, thanks for watching. Please like this video and make sure you are subscribed to the Draw Stuff Real Easy channel. You can support my videos by following me on my Patreon page. Put your drawing idea requests in the comments box below and remember to keep drawing, drawing, drawing. Practice, practice, practice and I'll see you next time. You take care now. Bye bye.